Hello guys, welcome to the last tutorial of 2018. I hope you had a really nice year and I hope you will have a good Christmas in case you celebrated and a happy new year. So today I'm going to show you how to make fake collisions. Maybe you have seen in some demo reels uh, that have cars, they have sometimes a control in the wheel that when you move it up, it does this type of collision. So you can use it in the ground and it looks like it's actually um, colliding the gravity, the, the wheel with, with, the, with the ground. You can also use it, for example, in a camera. For example, you have a character that is crashing with the camera and you want the face or the hand to look like it's actually colliding with it. You can use this technique as well. It's very, very easy. There are many um, tutorials related about this in in the internet, but some of them are quite complex using a lot of math and notes and stuff that I mean is great because that's not actually fake collision that is real collision but in this case I want to keep it simple and use just something that is useful in productions that just need the just need the stuff to get done and that's it. So I'm just going to put this control in zero zero and I'm going to delete the magic here. And I'm going to make this again. So it's very very easy. You just select the wheel or any object you want. Go to the form lattice. I'm going to make a seven division lattice in T divisions. In this case for this object I think it's, it's nice to have this but you can change this number depending on your object. Select the last line of vertex of the lattice, these four, make a cluster and move it up. Move it up until this, this line of vertex goes almost the same as the second lattice, second line of vertex in the lattice, like that. And now select all of them, put it inside the collider control. So when you move the control low, you see that you have collision and not collision, okay? But when you move it up, it starts getting this weird deformation that we don't want, like that. So to avoid this, I'm going to select the lattice, go to Attribute Editor, Outside Lattice, and put All instead of inside. And now, it doesn't matter where I put it, it's colliding all around without doing weird deformations. I can also rotate it and, and so. Obviously, if you go too up, it's, it's going to lose the... I mean, so don't move it too up, <laughs> just move it where you need it. And Basically this is it, then you can just hide this, hide this and tell all your friends that you're doing some awesome stuff and it's actually very simple. You can put this in your demo reel as well. So I hope you find this useful, I hope you can use it in your projects and thanks for watching and see you next year. Bye.